Namaste. Namaste. Here I am. I'm so blessed, you know. I only take five minutes from my apartment to here, where I am now. As you see, I'm sitting on the cut tree. On the, how it say, I don't know, I'm not American, I'm not English, I don't know what it is. Cut tree, I say. It's cold. My hands are a little bit freezing. You know, snowing. But I do this every day. If there is sun, I will go there on the hill and I will meditate on the sun and watch the sun. And if there is no sun, I go in the morning here usually. Because here is this beautiful... What this is? I don't know what this is. It's a wood, cut wood. It was tree once. Okay. <laughs> I have it on my tongue. I cannot get it. Sorry. But why do I do this? And especially these days, I'm not sleeping 14 days at night, almost nothing. I'm sleeping at day. And this is very important. Grounding. Grounding. I don't care if my hands are freezing, I should take my gloves, but I didn't. I don't care that it's cold. You will find me meditate even on such cold morning when then it's minus 4 or 5 degrees Celsius. Why? I'm sitting here. I'm not sitting for long because it's cold. But I sit to ground. The amazing power of mother nature is so amazing and so healing and all my miraculous healing not all but so much of miraculous healing that i experienced in my mental state in my physical state all the miracles all the mental issues healed and physical issues healed that the doctor said that could never heal i can only say thank you to mother to mother gaia because it's very important. I'm so blessed. I know that everybody is not so blessed that they will go five minutes and they will be in the forest. But I'm telling you, everybody here is so blessed and I'm the only one here. People don't know the treasure. That's why they're all sick. That's why they all problems. I tell you, I'm very sensitive. I have a lot of stress in me when I'm dealing with Facebook and with comments. I feel every energy, I feel everything, and I don't like many things. And it piles up within me. So when I go here in the morning, I release everything. Everything. What is not mine, everything. What I, you know, working with technology, always on phone, a little bit addicted to social media, to this phone, to computer. I realized this morning I should not check my comments so much. I should do my work and not focusing on comments because this is what I should do. Answer is within. And I get stressed. And when I don't sleep, I get also stressed. I'm very sensitive. But I know what to do. I come here, I release everything what I accumulated in past day. I release down to mother's Gaia's heart. Mother takes and mother gives me healing, gives me love, gives me warm. I'm sitting on a very cold, it's cold, it's freezing. I'm sitting on wood, but I feel mother's warm heart warming me. I'm telling you, I will stand up because I was sitting now for 15 minutes and it's not okay to sit so long because it's really cold. But I just want to tell you some things. This is very important. If you can do this, if you... I know everybody doesn't have the opportunity to go in nature, but if you can anywhere during the day find a spot, ground, or even concrete, when you can stand on, when you can sit on, and you ground yourself. It's so important to stay grounded, to stay fixed. I know in the morning sometimes I have weird comments, weird reactions, but after meditation I'm fixed. You know, everything goes. What doesn't belong in my body goes within mother's heart. Oh, it's cold, I'm freezing. And I receive power, I receive love, 
I receive everything, healing from Mother. That's important to stay grounded because, beloved angels, you know, we are receiving light codes and half of the light codes are for our own ascension and half of what we are receiving is for Mother's Gaia ascension. So all the light workers are called to every day if they can somewhere everywhere everyone can even in the city in the porch outside of the building sometimes somewhere you can stand on the bare ground sit on the bare ground and release those coats that you received for mother's gaia ascension you know these coats are not meant for you and that's why if we do not ground ourselves if we do not go out and ground ourselves we are chaotic, we are going crazy, chaos, 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 no balance, no harmony. I'm telling to my friend, my best friend always, he doesn't go out, but he's living in the forest. I'm telling him, don't do that. You would be greater than my stage already if you would every day go to forest and meditate a little bit and like this. I see some people, you know, live in the village and they don't appreciate it so much they don't go to nature like I go every day but some people listening this video now they living in a city you're living in a city and you would feel so blessed and grateful if you could have what I have now and sit here and release all this matrix stuff I know so if you are living in nature don't be crazy, don't be dumb, don't be insane. Just know how blessed you are and go out every day in nature. Mother Gaia will fill you up like here in forest. You will release your garbage. You will receive Mother's love and you will be at peace and full of power on Father's light and Mother's love. There is no Father's light today, so I'm here and beautiful and you know uh, so many diseases now even some doctors are confirming this that many diseases cannot be healed without the specific charge that earth has and this charge we have to receive by sitting on our butt or better being barefoot I'm not barefoot now because it's cold and I have boots on, I don't want to take it off and everything. But I sit here and I ground myself, I meditate here, I feel the energy going down, I feel energy coming up, I feel what is not in alignment within me. And just now I was praying for my sleep to fix, that I can sleep at night and work at the day, because this is insane and I know mother will help me. If I go every day here, I release and I ask for healing. <laughs> We can do, we can sit first, we are releasing our gratitude and our love to mother down, then we ask mother to take what is not in alignment within our body, we ask and we release this down, we release and then we ask for healing from mother and then we meditate how we receive that healing, that love, that nurturing and it works, I know it works. I'm so blessed. I was completely mentally insane and physical so many. I'm just now spiritually insane, no more mentally insane. But I healed so much by Mother's nature, Mother's Gaia grace. Like I said, many diseases cannot be healed without Mother's nature, Mother's Gaia's charge. And they have given us this shit. They have given us this shit. Rubber, rubber boots, rubber stuff. So we are always disconnected, we are in chaos, we are never connected to Mother Gaia. We don't know that we are Mother Gaia's children. They have given us these boots, the rubber. And we are disconnected, we don't know that we are of Mother Earth and then we become of the world. World is the system, you know. So we should re reconnect. I was blessed all my life. As a child, I was always outside, always in forest. That was my mother because my mother left me. And I was always in forest, always running in forest. And 
even in my spiritual years. I tell you something, I cannot meditate in the house. Too much chaos, too much this close, then I grab my phone, then I grab this, then I grab that. I mean, even here I grab my phone and check during meditation one time or two times, I'm crazy. But I can really go deep. I can really sink in, in Mother Nature. I always, if there is sun, I will find a spot where I can sit and where I can sun gaze. And if there's no sun, I will always go to forest. Usually I go two times. In the morning, I'm sun gazing and meditating. In the afternoon, I'm coming here or somewhere else in the forest and grounding and communing with Mother. Like I say, we are disconnected by rubber boots, by rubber this and on the, the bottom of our shoes. And we are in chaos. We don't know. We are mothers, Gaia's children. We don't release our baggage into mother's core and we don't receive her love, her healing. But as less doctors have proven for many diseases, you cannot heal them without that specific charge of Mother Gaia. And what I love to do also, beloved angels, what I love to do here also is, oh, you know, here there are this, this beautiful old trees, you see, these beautiful old trees. And I just love to... I love my phone, because now I can really rest, I can do this video... Uh, I can upload it, I can, I should do more work in Mother Nature because I know you love to watch that kind of videos which are in Mother Nature and you receive the energy. So I'm here now with a tree. I love to, you know, I put my hands like this, one hand here, and I just love to pray, I love to meditate, I love to connect if there is, you know, if you cannot sit like me, or if there is a rain, or there is a, if there is a rain and snow, I will not sit anywhere, it has to be dry. Then I just come here, I put my head like this, and I put my hands, and I ground, and I ground, and I'm communing with this tree now. Oh, she, this tree has so many information, so much light so much everything i'm one with the tree i'm one with my mother and i'm going down into the mother's gaia's heart and taking her love her blessings up with me in the heart in my center and this is if you can hug a tree if you can really mm, i kiss a tree i don't have a girlfriend but she's beautiful, Mwah. you know, and I feel the love. And as you see me now here, you see me how I became soft, how I became tender, how this tree loves me, this tree knows me for thousands of years. We were before together this tree was with me in India 5,000 years ago in a different body oh oh <laughs> you see this is what happens I forgot I'm making video and I'm just speaking what I'm receiving oh so much love so much love I'm sorry I cannot say anything anymore I said everything I just feel so blessed and I bless everybody and commune with Mother Nature. Hawk, hawk, hawk trees. Sit on the ground, connect, and you will heal. There is tremendous healing, mental, emotional, physical. Everything can heal in faith with Mother Nature. Just we have to go to Mother Nature. I have to go every day. So, thank you for watching. I'm feeling like, oh, I'm feeling like cuddly. Thank you for watching and go in Mother Nature, commune with Mother Nature. 
You can heal in Mother Nature the things that they say you cannot heal. Doctors told me I should be so sick now. I should be I don't know what now. But I am a master teacher and healer. And I love you. And be blessed. And pleased. If this... If my work resonates with you and you want to support my work, do know this is what I do and this is how I live. And if you feel in your heart you want to share a coin with me or whatever, per your choice, even one dollar is so much. Please, I'll put my pay PayPal down and I'm so grateful for everyone. So please be blessed. Connect with Mother Gaia. You are a child of Mother Gaia. Run free, I cannot wait. When it's warm again, I can be barefoot non-stop. I'm barefoot non-stop in summer. I'm barefoot non-stop ten months, eight months per year. I'm barefoot non-stop. Four months, I keep shoes on. And even now, I take it off usually. But when I sit on the trunk, trunk, yes, trunk. Now I know it's a trunk. When I sit on the trunk of a tree, I don't eat to be barefoot, like this. Namaste, we are the children of Mother Gaia, and this tree really loves us all. Yeah, this tree is my old friend. Mwah. I go speaking a little bit with the tree more, to receive so much. You be blessed, please, I love you. Namaste, 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 namaste.